Hello managers and welcome back to another video. Today we have the top 3 formations for March. This is a special episode because we have an amazing manager. If you want to suggest your own formation, follow the link in the description below. Fill your informations about your formation so we can feature in our next video. These formations are suggested by other managers. Their names can be found in the description. Before we start with the formations, join our group called Top 11 United for weekly giveaways and competitions. And everything that you need as a manager, link of our group is always in the description below. Also visit my blog for news and updates about Top 11. Let's try to hit 100 likes on this video and let's roll. Our first formation is suggested by the Top 11 United legend Peter Wren. If you are a member of Top 11 United, you will see that he has done some incredible plays this season. On your screen you can see his away game in the Champions League. He won 3-4 away versus a 170% opponent. So I reached him on Facebook, and I asked him about this tactics and order and this is what he said. He uses a 4-1-2-3. It looks like a 4-5-1 V style but in fact it is a 4-1-2-3. As you can see we have 4 defenders placed in the same line. Above them there is a DMC who is in the middle of his box. In the midfield we have two MC, they are close to each other holding the midfield and creating chances. On top we have two wingers and one striker. So you are thinking this is an average formation, but don't worry we asked him about what is special about the formation. To make this formation work you will need to set the team mentality to hard defending I will explain afterwards why. Focus passing to down both flanks, passing style to long, and forced counter attacks to on. In defense you need to set the pressing style to low, tackling style to hard, marking style to zonal and don't play the offside trap. I asked him why he is pressing low, he told me that because he is playing counter attacks. So he wants the whole enemy team to enter his half, so if they make a mistake he can counter them easily. He also said that this kind of tactic works perfectly with very high quality opponents. Now I will let you see a game where he performed with this formation. Moving on, we have our second formation suggested by Missile Donald. He suggested a 3-1-2-2-2. As you can see on your screen, 
This is a normal formation. In defense we have three defenders playing as central defenders as DC. This formation is without DR and DL. Above the main defenders we have one DMC, who is placed in the middle of his box. Moving on, in the midfield we have two MC. They are also played in the same line. On the wing we have two wingers and they play behind the striker. On top we have two strikers. All you need to set for this formation is the team mentality to defensive, focus passing to mixed, passing style to short and force counter attacks to on. In defense, pressing style to low, tackling style to normal, marking style to zonal and don't play the offside trap. Now you can see some clips of me using this formation. And our last formation is a 3-1-2-3-1. This formation was suggested by R.I. for Raman Supriyo. On your screen now you can see his formation. He is playing with three defenders in the same line. Above them we have one DMC and in the midfield we have two MC. Above the midfield we have one AMC who is supporting the solo striker on top. And beside them we have two wingers, running down the pitch. He said that he used this formation for the past two seasons. In those two seasons he won the league twice, won the Champions League, also he was a cup runner-up and also Champions League runner-up. But unfortunately he didn't send me a picture with the orders and I had to go with my own with help of some other's manager and we came up with these orders. All you need to set for this formation is the team mentality to normal, focus passing to through the middle, passing style to short, and play forced counter-attacks to on. In defense, pressing style to high, tackling style to normal, marking style to man to man and play off sign trap to on.
That's all I had to say for today's update. Like I said in the intro, join our group top 11 united for giveaways and competitions. Also don't forget to visit my blog to find out some good tips and tricks about the game. Don't forget to follow me on social media at Petra2G. Make sure you slap that like button and let's try to hit 100 likes on this video. Show some support by pressing that subscribe button and turn on your notification alert so you won't miss a video. Thanks for watching and I will see you in my next video. Take care and peace.